habanero seasoning from hell. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy shit. Mark. <laughs> so profesh. Hey everyone, I'm Tanner. Uh, welcome to Tanner Tries. Today, we are joined by Tia Lupita. Yeah, Tia Lupita. So today we're gonna be trying some of their delicious cactus chips that I believe are hot sauce flavored and also that they have gourmet hot sauces. We're gonna be giving a taste, but in addition to that, we're gonna be trying hot shit today. Uh, I don't really know what I'm in for quite yet. The spiciest thing that I've eaten in a while is a Dorito. Do we start? We all want to try something new. A new recipe, a workout, a style, anything, but too often we give up before we even get started. Not me, I'm Tanner. I'm not a chef, I'm not a health nut, and I'm not a stylist, but I am someone who is determined to try anything and everything to prove to myself and to you that everything is worth a try. Welcome to Tanner Tries. So before we begin, I'm gonna kind of explain how this goes. So we have uh, what I like to call a Goldilocks scale. Not hot enough, which I would say is like a one on the scale, just right, which would presumably be a five. And then we are gonna have just way too fucking hot, which is a 10. I don't foresee a lot of things uh, on the one side of the scale because I have a very low tolerance for spice and heat. So I'm really excited we're doing this at 10 a.m. Um, I'm nervous. This is like getting on a roller coaster or going on a date, which I haven't been on in a really long time. First up, Flamin' Hot Cheetos, which I've had before. Yeah. No, those are really good. Oh, okay, then the heat comes in. I don't know if like a whole bag of these would be incredible for like my colon, but I'll give it a six. It's good. What am I looking at? <laughs> <laughs> Some gray ass tater tots and sriracha. What a wonderful breakfast. I've put sriracha on plenty of things. That's big. that's good. Not, mm. I'd say this is similar to flaming hot Cheetos. Um yeah, I'll give it a six. I think I've put it on pot belly sandwiches before, which I can't eat pot belly anymore, I'll my pants. Oh, we have Tia Lupita the OG sauce and the habanero, and then we have some of their hot sauce chips. Should I just put the hot sauce on, on the chip? Okay, right, cool. Tia Lupita tells the story of one man's quest to bring the bright, bold flavors of his Mexican home right to your table. Founded by Hector Salvador in honor of his mother, Lupita, Hector has given the world the gift of his mother's recipes. Their hot sauces are made with locally sourced, clean and simple ingredients with no added sugar. They're also non-GMO and gluten-free certified with a variety of hot sauces, tortillas, and tortilla chips. Tia Lupita elevates any taco night to another level. Well, let's try just a bare chip first. Mmm. Ooh, that was good. Nice flavor. Um, yeah, Tia did the damn thing. Let's put a little BOG on here. Oh, fuck. Okay. Mmm. <laughs> Yum. Mmm. Ooh, that's really nice. You know, when you have like a very manageable hot sauce and it's just like sort of lightly blanketing the tongue? That's what that is. And that was not verbiage from the brand. That just came out of my mouth. That's good. That has good flavor. Oh, gee. That tastes like a, not like a much better Tabasco sauce. And then we have the habanero. There we go. A petite little drop. There we go. Mmm. I like that. Ooh, yeah. That's really good. That one's, I mean, it's all good, but that's really delicious. Tealupita. Depth of flavor. Not too spicy. That's like a perfect, th those are like, that's like a perfect vibe. That is just right. Tilupita, you're perfect. Is this horseradish? Horseradish? That looks um, inedible. Ooh. <laughs> so no one knows what peppers these are, what kind of peppers these are. Um, do we really not know? Is it a chili? I'm not getting anything yet. Oh. <coughs> oh, oh god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Woo! 
Oh, <laughs> yeah, baby. Now we're cooking with gas. That's really hot. Ooh. That's really, really yeah. hot. That, I mean, for me. Mama. I really spicy stuff. Oh wow, God. I did not think I'd have that reaction. I thought it'd calm down right now, but it just hasn't. <laughs> I feel like I'm giving birth. Oh <sighs> Next one. I know we have hotter things to eat, but I, I want to say that they're probably, I mean, for me, like an eight. Those were unbearable. Maybe a nine. I couldn't eat it. Yeah, no, never again in my life. So we have this habanero seasoning from hell, beyond hot. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Holy shit. Lightly dusted Z. <laughs> okay, so far so good. Actually, no, it's not getting hot at all. Beyond hot? I think that uh, the most shocking thing was smelling it. That went right up into my uh, brain. Unless this kicks in in like 10 minutes. Three? I, I must have a higher spice tolerance than I originally thought. This is good. I'm still looking at those peppers. We're, no, no, no. Oh. Oh. We've reached a bomb. I don't know if there's much to say about this. If you watch the show Hot Ones, you know that this particular sauce um, is the one that celebrities will get to and they'll be losing their minds, more so than even the ones that are supposed to be technically hotter. Beyond Insanity Hot Sauce. I think I vaguely remember from the videos that it has like a skull, Skullville, is that the thing? Yeah, of, yeah it's like absurd. I'm tempted, I'm not gonna smell it before, I'm just gonna put it on there, okay? Fuck. Uh, okay. <laughs> like I'm delaying death. Yeah, 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 okay. Okay, let's just do it, let's do it. Mm. Oh God. <coughs> oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh. Right, I'm grabbing creeper. That's hot. That's hot. I'm burping. That's really hot. Oh my God. Oh. Shut up. Oh my god. 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 Oh. 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 That was not I get drunk right now. Oh my god. Okay. Oh my god. That was awful. Where's the water? Oh. just so bad. This is like going to be like a deathbed memory. It's interesting because, okay, now I can actually talk about it. It's like, the first three seconds, you get nothing. And then at the very back of your throat, it is like something popped, which might have been, it felt like my brain stem burst. And then, it's still there. And then it goes down. I can't even, I, I literally have to wait to do the wrap up before this is done. I'm, I'm fully experiencing this. Takeaways from today. I. Uh, I enjoyed most of the stuff. I thought the peppers were gonna be the worst of it. And then uh, I did the very generous portion of the bomb. That was an assault to my body. Um, my, admittedly, my favorite thing, Tia Lupita, that was like a beautiful mirage in now the desert that is my body and mouth. Really, really tasty, uh, both the hot sauce and the chips. I, I can't say today was, um, fun, but I learned a lot. Thank you for joining me on Tanner Tries today. We'll see you next time, only on Shopflix. <clears throat> wow, I need more ice.